Good day everyone. Welcome back again to my channel. For today's video, I will teach you how to multiply a number by itself using the easiest method. Pwede rin i-apply ang ating long method to check kung tama ang iyong sagot at kapag nalaman mo na ang shortcut method na ito, pwede mo siyang i-apply. Pwede ba siya kahit sa large number? Pwede pwede. Simulan na natin ang ating tutorial. Okay, multiply a number by itself. Ibig sabihin, magmumultiply tayo ng number sa kanyang sarili. Okay, ituturo ko ngayon kung ano yung shortcut method para magmultiply ng number sa kanyang sarili. For example, gawin muna natin ang ating long method. 16 times 16. Inumultiply natin ang 6 times 6. 36. Carry 3. 6 times 1, 6 plus 3, 9. Then 1 times 6 is 6. 1 times 1 is 1. Bring down 6. Then add 9 plus 6, 15. Carry 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. Therefore, the product is 256. Okay, now let's do our shortcut method. You only have to do is to rewrite 16 times 16 into exponential form. We have 16 squared. Okay, ang unang gagawin mo lang dito, ang ating first digit is 1, ang ating second digit ay 6, square mo lang yung ating second digit. 6 squared, ganun pa rin ang 6 squared, nagmumultiply pa rin tayo, 6 times 6, that is 36. Carry 3. Then, ang shortcut natin, I-multiply na lang natin ang lahat ng digit na ito, 1, 6, at saka 2. Huwag natin isasama yung ating carry 3. 1 times 6 is 6. I-times natin yung exponent na 2, magkakaroon tayo ng 12. Then saka naman natin i-add yung 12 plus 3, magkakaroon tayo ng 15. Then magkakaroon tayo ng carry 1. 1 squared, nandito na tayo sa first digit, square natin yung first digit. 1 squared is 1, plus 1 is 2. Wala na tayong long method, which is the same product, we have 256. Another example, Okay, papaano naman, if you're going to multiply a number by itself, how about kapag large number? Kapag sobrang laki ng number? Hindi lang 15, hindi lang 14, hindi lang 12. How about 79? Mumultiply natin ang 79 times 79. We're going to apply this concept, the shortcut method. Ikaw na lang ang bahala mag-check kung tama ang magiging sagot natin. Okay. Square lang natin yung ating second digit. Ito ang ating first digit. Again, ang ating second digit ay 9. Ang ating first digit is 7. 9 squared or 9 times 9 is 81. Then after that, i-multiply mo lang ang 7 times 9 times 2. Check natin. 7 times 9 is 63. 63 times 2 is 126. 126, i-add natin yung 8. 126 plus 8 is 134. Isa lang ang ilalagay natin dito. 134, 1, 3, 4. 13 ang ating i-carry sa taas. Then after that, square natin yung first digit. 7 squared is 49. 49 plus 13 is we have 12. 4 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1 is 6. We have 62. Therefore, the product is 6,241. 